Um, this video demonstrates a new feature in error reporting in the grid component. So you can see here we have a grid that is formatted as a form and what I've done is um, just going to simulate an error, uh, uh, a row level error um, uh, over here. You can see on the events, on the can update event, I've just set it to um, the cancel to true and I've set this error message here. So this is, this is in effect just forcing a row level um, error. Um, and uh, so let's see what happens now when we, when we run the grid. Now the grid in this case has a lot of fields in it. So um, uh, let's say that I go here and I uh, fill in a field and then hit the submit button. And basically what, what happens is um, a row level error is always indicated by um, an icon in the uh, row selector column and when you put your mouse over the icon you actually get the error message but um, uh, in many users cases the uh, form is so long uh, it has so many fields on it that uh, that the user uh, does not notice this icon um, over here and so they miss the error uh, that has occurred so a new option has been added uh, to update settings over here where you can specify that um, that row errors should also be displayed in a pop-up window. So this is in addition to the icon that appears over there, there's now going to be a pop-up window and you can see here that you can um, uh, you know, set the style of that pop-up window. So let's go now and uh, do a, a, a preview and uh, say make a change over there. Uh, scroll down, hit the submit button and you can see now we get basically, we get a pop-up window here that gives us um, um, uh, data about all of the errors that occurred and when I click OK the, but the window is dismissed but the icon is still there for the user to continue to actually go back and see what errors uh, th there were. Now this is um, displaying um, the uh, pop-up window in the grid part. The same feature also exists in the detail view as well. So. Um, a nice new option for displaying uh, row level errors uh, in the grid and uh, making them more uh, obtrusive so that the user uh, will definitely notice them. Thank you very much.